We have found that there's a lot of people that are interested in real estate investing and not sure where to start. So today I'm going to cover the five steps to get started in real estate investing. I'm Tigo Venturi with the Venturi Group of Real Broker in Albuquerque, New Mexico. The first step is determine your goal. Are you looking for a short-term investment, long-term investment, depending on what your priorities are? Short-term investment, that would be the flip. That would be the traditional short-term investment. You buy something, you fix it up, you resell it. Long-term investment, that's some a property you purchase, you rent it, you get the benefit of rental income, you get the benefit of tax uh, savings potentially, and you get the benefit of potential equity gain over time. So those are the two categories. So kind of determine what your outcome is that you want for that investment. Second piece is research the market. You don't want to just jump in without kind of knowing what homes are selling for, what homes are renting for, for example. So do your research up front. You can get a real estate professional to help you with that. Learn the basics, get educated. There's tons of great books. This is one of my favorites all time, The Millionaire Real Estate Investor. But there's so many good books about real estate investing. It can be a little overwhelming. So pick a few and just go with it and see what uh, speaks to you. Uh, Bigger Pockets is a outfit that has great education, great books. That's one to look into. Another good uh, resource is networking. There's a lot of real estate investing networking groups as well as if you can find a mentor, somebody that has done this before, that's probably gonna be your best tip for getting educated on real estate investing. The fourth thing is get your network, get your network of people to help you. First off, a real estate professional. Real estate professional, you can you can bounce ideas off them, you can help them, they can help you research the market and get you data about what is going on in the market. And get somebody that's going to speak clearly to you because you don't want somebody who says, oh, yeah, that's going to work. Yeah, no problem. No, you want somebody that's going to say, you know, that might not be such a great idea. At least you can have that dialogue and get somebody just to, again, like I said, bounce those ideas off. The next thing is you may need a mortgage lender. Uh, You know, leveraging your investment is a great strategy to not have as much of your own money in an investment. So get a lender. There's a lot of different categories there, short-term, long-term, but you do want to get a a lender to help you. And most real estate agents can help you find that person. The last thing is if you're going to be fixing up houses, or even if you're renting houses, you want a contractor, somebody you can go to for fix up and repair if you need that. And then the last thing is look at a lot of properties. And when I say look at, I don't mean go and tour every single home, but look at a lot of properties online, seeing what things are listed for see what things are selling, how quick things are selling. So you get a really good idea of the market, different parts of town that you may be interested in investing in. And so you know it when that property does come up that you want, you've done your research and you know if it is the one or not. And again, if you want to get help on that, we can help you with that. If you want to know about the Albuquerque market, follow me. Um, I do a lot of market uh, data on the Albuquerque market, always putting stuff out there. It's Tigo Venturi with the Venturi Group with Real Broker. Thanks for watching. You can reach us at 505-448-8888. Take care.